they are blazing the path for the people behind them. So they came to today's meeting hoping to find their piece of the American dream. These men and women from all ages, races, and backgrounds are hoping to gain the skills that will allow them to become painters, bricklayers, carpenters, and plumbers, and join the trade unions that provide good wages for those jobs. I would like a career that, will, that should be able to help me support my family. Emmanuel Chapman recently got out of prison and has struggled to find steady work. So I'm here to try to get a certification so I won't be denied as much. It's called the Bridge to Construction Apprenticeship Program under the auspices of Metropolitan Family Services. More than 20 of these applicants will be picked to take part in a 10-week training program, teaching them skills that will help them get an apprenticeship in one of Chicago's three dozen trade unions. Making sure that black and brown communities are able to get individuals to be in the construction trade. And they'll be paid to learn about 15 bucks an hour during the 10-week program, which opens the door to people who otherwise couldn't afford to take part. And we try to establish a forged relationship within the trade unions, right? Find out what it is that they're looking for in individuals, right, to be successful in that particular trade. While anyone can apply for the program, they're encouraging people from poor communities who are often shut out of construction projects right in their own neighborhood. And people that live in this area need to have access to the employment opportunities that are here. So it would be great if they can get the training to prepare them to work on those developments as they arise. The only requirements to apply, you must be at least 18, an Illinois resident, and have a high school diploma diploma or GED. Um, actually my boyfriend told me about it and I got interested. Um, plumbing is something I always wanted to do. On the southeast side, Dane Placco, Fox 32 Chicago.